The sprawling city of Caligan was once at the forefront of scientific research. Its progress was suddenly halted by the invasion of a rival state, hellbent on stealing its technology. Desperate to survive, Caligan scientists developed a breed of super soldiers to turn the tide. The Arbiters. You are the first Arbiter. Hello everyone, today we're checking out a brand new game. This game's called Foregone. It's a uh, side-scrolling, platforming, adventuring kind of game. Uh, it's obviously see, uh, sort of like a pixelated kind of version of a game. Uh, this does have controller support, so I'm playing with the controller today, but you can actually play with the keyboard as well. Once I figure out all the controls, there we go. Um, so if you prefer the keyboard, you can do it as well, but I, I think I prefer using the controller for the most part. Uh, this game, of course, is on the Epic Game Store. If you would like to secure a copy of the game yourself, uh, there will be a link in the description down below. Now, that is an affiliate link, so any purchase there does help support the channel as well. Uh, so very much appreciated for that. Um, now, this uh, this game comes out, I believe, on fe February 27th. Uh, you can access and pre-order it now if you're so interested. Uh, but uh, the game will be available then. Ow, that hurt. Not in the face. I gotta figure out all the controls and stuff in this. So, ranged attack, we got... Uh, we have a melee attack. Um, don't really know a whole lot about the lore behind this game. I haven't, haven't really seen too much about it just yet, um, but hopefully more of that will be revealed as we play along. Obviously, there's a little intro thing where it says that we were... Ow, that really hurt my face. Uh, we were uh, developed to defend the our country or city-state or whatever from some enemy. Ah, ah there's, I know there's a way to slide. How do I do it? How do I slide again? I know I did it, I did it earlier for a second, and then I forgot how. Oh, there we go. Okay, so we can slide. That will help us get by some of the enemies and stuff. Um, so I know we were developed to try to defend our uh, our place from some enemy. Which I guess are these kind of ugly dudes. They look a little... A little more... Oh, that hurt. They look a little morbid. It was like zombie creature kind of things. Uh, but hopefully we'll, we'll, get, uh, we'll get some more information about the game revealed as we play through it. I think this level here is kind of like a tutorial level. Seems to be anyway, because it's kind of like giving us the uh, all the moves and stuff. So once we get past this, it should be cool. Um, this is a, like a like a was it 16 bit or 18 bit graphics or whatever. Um, but they've done a really nice job of it. I mean, look at even her hair is flowing. Oh, that hurt my face. She's got these luxurious flowing locks to go along with her whistling sword. Ow! Ah! I right, clearly need to work on my combat a little bit. Okay, I don't like getting shot. This is not my favorite. I think I do more damage when I do jump attacks. I can also double jump too, which is good. Ow! That hit me while I was jumping. Okay, one down. So we get health and ammo from killing the guys in melee attacks. At least I think we're getting health. And we're also collecting these coins, so I'm assuming at some point there's gonna be some sort of like a market system where we can buy upgrades for things. Uh, I know there is an inventory in here so we can get like different weapons and stuff. Let's see if we can pull that up. That's not it. There we go. Uh, so we have an inventory, so we have things like, uh, there's our melee weapon, and I guess it looks like we have a bunch of different options of that we're going to get. Um, ranged weapon, armor, I'm not sure what this is, or this, for that matter. Uh, but, and then there's also a map on here. Uh, we can zoom out and kind of see where we're going, but I don't, uh, don't have a lot revealed there, so I guess it's not going to show a whole lot. Carving up these little guys. Um, so this being like the tutorial level again, there's uh, there's kind of like there's a section after this where hopefully we get a little bit more of the story. That really hurts, buddy. Oh, stop it! No, don't shoot me. Whew. Yeah, I definitely get health when I kill stuff, so that's good. I'm I'm not the exceptional at this, so I'm gonna assume I'm gonna need a lot of help with them, the uh, the whole healing business. <laughs> Turned around. That's right. Attack behind you. That's the most effective strategy. Ow! That's like some crazy blunderbuss attack or something. Oh, oh no, nope, that hurt. I guess it's not a blunderbuss, it's like a machine gun. Don't shoot me. Oh, yeah, where's my gun? Wait a minute, it's supposed to it's supposed to automatically aim at the at the nearest target, but apparently it's not interested in doing that. Oh, okay, two for one. Okay, good. Good heal. Whew! I don't know. I don't think I got wall jump in this. I tried that once already and it didn't work out too good. Okay, I can look down. Uh, so down here we got another one of these dudes. It's weird, like time paused for a second there as I was coming down. 
Woo! Missed me. Okay. The one thing I'm finding with the controller is when I let go of the control stick, the character's turning around and facing the other direction. That's not... That's not what I would call ideal. It's gotta be smacked a couple times. Okay, I wanna go up and see what's up here. There are a lot of enemies though, so if I die, this may this may turn out poorly for me. No, thank goodness, a little bonus healing. What have we here? Ooh, secret bonus area. Give me them coins. There wasn't any healing in there. I've also got seven of these blue coins, which I'm not sure what we can do with those. Maybe those are for spending on like special abilities or something. Oh, dodge that attack. It almost looked like I knew what I was doing. I don't, but it almost looked like it. I think you can, oh yeah, you can also use the D-pad on this instead of the control stick. That might actually help with my, my problem with turning around backwards. Yeah, now it's like, now it's like playing an old Nintendo game. <laughs> it's interesting that they won't jump down. I'm getting free hits on them here. I'm not going to complain about this at all. There we go. Freebies. Get him! Oh. Oh, there's a door there. Okay, hold on. we got to activate this. Uh, right button to activate. Thank you. Oh, I got him with the big hit, but not the, uh, not the other hits. Oh, that one hurt. Funny when I was sliding towards the guy, the shots didn't hit me. Sliding away, not nearly as effective. It's kind of a neat art style. It's interesting to have like this low, like this low definition graphics, but have still have like the flowing hair and everything. <laughs> Can't get over that. Oh boy! Oh, that's gonna hurt. Oh no no, that was my face. Uh, where's my gun? Start using this thing more. Woo! Give me them hearts. Thank you. Wow. It's pretty bad when you die on the tutorial level. That's. Oh, what's going on here? Oh, big dude. Uh, don't hurt me. <laughs> can we cheese this guy too? Uh, apparently we can. Oh, look, can I shoot him? Oh, jeez. Oh, I'm out of ammo. Do I, get, do I get ammo back for every hit? Oh, I do. How about that? I thought maybe I have to kill him to get the to get the ammo back. But apparently not. Eat gun. That's right. <laughs> if you can't get your win honestly, just cheese it. Ooh, what's going on here? Ah! No. Is that a boss. Once couldn't something stay dead? <sighs> Change that was. Plans, I suppose. That was oddly cryptic. It, what do you mean, stay dead? I didn't even kill that thing. Is there going to be some weird backstory here? Welcome to whatever this place never is. Thought I'd be going back to the temple. Yeah, the temple. That place. I never thought I'd be back here either. You don't know what the temple is. Oh, that's not really there. over here. What? Wait, that just took me in a straight loop. There was literally no reason to go up there. That's amazing. This place is always ah. Oh, wrong button. Oh. I, swear, oh, I swear I should remap the buttons. Ah. Yeah, that's right. Eat bullets. I'm not going to have very many shots left, but... Oh, I see the top there. It shows my ammo. I didn't even notice that before. Now I'm all out. Ah. Oh, this guy hits hard. There we go. Eat it. I don't approve of your spinningness. Ah! How did these guys not get dizzy? I was gonna walk into the back end of his spinning there for a second. Okay, we've got ammo again. It looks like I max out maybe at 14 shots or so. I really want to wall jump. I wonder if that's a thing later in the game. 
Now does this it's die? even worse. I don't know who that is, but he doesn't look very friendly. I don't know what just happened there, but that was weird. Dream? Forget it. Stick to the mission. Stick to the mission. Oh, all right. So I gotta stick to the mission, but I don't know what the mission is. I mean, aside from knowing I have to kind of defend places. Oh, that's cool. We're here. Welcome to Forgone. I did really enjoy... Oh, what's this now? Right button to collect. Gimme, gimme. That's right. Left trigger to use that ability. I gotta watch I don't accidentally hit the left trigger. Um, I did really enjoy games like Hollow Knight, so hopefully this um, hopefully this one's really cool too. It's got some good uh, good story elements to it, hopefully. Oh, boom. Oh, I like that ability. I wonder if I can use that in midair. If so, that would be great. I kind of like these pixelated art style kind of games. Right button for oratory. Well, I'm gonna give a speech. Oh, what is this? Uh, okay. Skill trees. Okay, so we have a. It says I should hit left trigger to go back, but I can't. <laughs> uh, momentum. You have a 5, 10, 15, 20, 25 percent chance to gain haste. Increase movement speed by 5 percent. Last five seconds. Stacks up to three times. Okay. Bloodthirst. Leech, steal life when attacking enemies. I feel like that's probably the one I should be most on top of taking since I'm getting hit so often. Unstable strikes. Uh, dealing damage is a uh, chance of explosive strikes. All right, so explosive charge. Explodes at max stacks or when the duration ends. Last five seconds, stacks up to five times. I mean, I oh, I see, yeah, that's what those, those um, the blue points are for. I buy these things with them. Latched to a target, damaging on movement and breaking at max distance. Contagion, deal damage over time, spread to a nearby enemies. And increase physical resistance by 10%. <laughs> Will work. Alright, well let's go with the one that's going to give me leech. Steal life when attacking. I will take that one, thank you. So we have the first level of that. I can refund it for 100 coins. Oh, interesting. So you spend the blue points to get these things and you can refund them for... Gold coin stuff. What's this over here? Oh, okay, so here's my ability stuff. I have surge right now. Dash forward, dealing damage to all enemies. Or 45 damage to all enemies in the path. I have it. Okay, so we can equip in here. Okay, so I wonder if I can only equip these things when I go to one of these oratory stages. I guess we'll have to see. Uh, but it looks like we have a, a whole bunch of things that we can unlock in this tree, so that'll be cool. A bunch of cool abilities and stuff. I'll take that. Uh, actually, can I go down here? I'm guessing no. Teleport! I really want to know what the teleporting is all about. Uh, the forge. I guess this is where we upgrade our equipment. Yes. All right. Can I buy stuff in here, too? Looks like I can only upgrade. I'm supposed to be able to hit left trigger to go back, but I can't. So we'll have to cycle around. I'm going to upgrade my sword, maybe. Equipment can be upgraded by spending gold. Each upgrade increases DPS or health by 10%. Has a chance to enhance an equipment modifier. Salvage. Equipment could be salvaged for gold. Upgraded equipment has an increased salvage value. Well, I would hope so. Uh, we currently have... Well, it doesn't say what the current damage on this thing is, but if we upgrade it... For 20 coins, that'll get power 15, DPS 33. Not bad. Let's maybe go over and upgrade our, our ranged weapon while we're at it. So we've got both of those upgraded. I don't have any armor and stuff, so I can't upgrade those. I was hoping there'd be like an armor shop here, but I guess not. Silent Hedges. All right, so we're in the woods. I'm the Hedge Knight. Looks like she's been busy. Better track her down before she can do any more damage. All right, so we're, we're tracking down some sort of a monster or something? Right button for outpost. What's this do? Oh, that's the teleporter. Oh. Oh, that's a really cool effect. I like that. All right, well, let's maybe let's maybe go back. It's kind of like the superhero landing. Oh, look at this. The box is back. We can get more coins. Oh, my gosh. That seems a little cheesy. I could just teleport back and forth and just get a whole bunch of coins. I mean, unless it costs to actually use that teleporter thing. I suppose that's possible, too. Oh, what do we got over here? Ow! Dude, that's my face! 
Ha! <laughs> weren't expecting that, were you? <gasps> Ooh, longbow. Uh, power 10, DPS 23. I'm gonna pick that up. I mean, I don't know if it's gonna be any good, but if nothing else, we can sell it. I have a handgun right now. I think because I've upgraded it, it has better damage. Um, should I have gone down? I wonder if I'm missing stuff by going this way. I wasn't really expecting choices in this, to be honest with you. Ow. Oh, yeah, that's right. Shoot the wrong direction. That's exactly the purpose of a gun. Whoop! Yeah, that's right. It's your buddy. He's already dead. But that's kind of a game. Oh, a ring. Increase critical strike chance by 5%. I wonder if that... Up Does that equip automatically? Okay so, okay, so that's what this thing is. I'm, I'm guessing it's equipped. How do I know when it's equipped? I guess... Oh, I see. It's got that little gray diamond at the bottom. It's equipped. Okay, so it wasn't... It didn't auto-equip it. I had to put it on. Uh, power 10, power 20. Definitely better DPS from the gun because I've upgraded it. So, not surprising there. Here we go. What's up here? Can I go up here? Can't get out. I kind of want to know what huh. was down through the bottom path. Looks like I'm on the right track. But apparently, I went the right way. What do we got here? Is that a healing ability? Right trigger. It is a healing ability. That's going to be super handy. Again, I you know I take a lot of damage in these games, so I'm going to need. Every little helping healing ability I can get my hands on. <laughs> I had to guess. Oh, I hit that guy. Stunk at me. That's right. Longbow again. Well, we'll pick these up because I can scrap them. We can get some gold and stuff for them. But it's interesting that there's multiple paths to go here. I, I actually I really wasn't expecting that. I don't think I'm in the woods necessarily anymore. Now I'm like somewhere else. Where does this go? Bonus room! Oh yeah, this is worth coming down for. Daggers! 7% chance to trigger aftershock, whatever that is. Uh, these are melee. And this is... Emblem, power 18, health 11, 11 plus 11% health. Okay, this was totally worth coming down here for. I wonder if I missed anything in that first one. Alright, let's go back in here. Make sure this is equipped. Power 16, DBS 36. I wonder if these things have... I'm, I'm guessing they don't have unlimited ammo, but... Nevertheless, uh, I'll keep the weapon I have. No use of the buttons here. I kind of want to know what's up topside now that I might be missing, but... Oh! What the? This guy's shoot. I don't know why that guy's got a weapon on him, but... No. Alright, you gotta go. Ow. Ow! I take exception to your shooting at my face. I'm not killing all of them. Forget that. Teleporter back to the outpost. I think when I hit it, I might get the waypoint. I guess we'll find out soon enough. Ow! <laughs> that was bad timing to jump. Yeah, that's right. That's what I thought. Ah! Okay, you know what? Oh! Not so grabby. Okay, I gotta keep using the D-pad. I keep using the control stick and it's it's messing me up. I'm turning around at the wrong times. Oh, what's over here? Oh, another big baddie. Ow. He's a little quicker than I expected him to be. Better heal. Looks like I can stop healing at any time, too. So I can use that in, in small increments. And save up the energy to use more later. That's kind of a way, neat way to do the healing. Ah! Stinky 
go. Going up. Yeah, more coins. Give me those. I feel like I should have gone the other way. I wonder if there's a way to go back. I guess I could, I guess I could just like run through it again after teleporting or something, maybe. Ooh, why was that guy... Emblem, power 19, health 11. What's that do? Power 19 versus power 18. Well, let's take the power 19, I guess. I guess I, I guess I can only have one of these equipped at a time. Plus 11 health, plus 6 health. I mean, the one gives me more health. 11% is a lot more than 6 total. I'll keep that one equipped. It shows the other one is up, and there's an upgrade just because the power's higher, but... Ah! Stop spitting at me. Ow. Ah, oh, I thought I got away from that one. I like poison or something? The screen's all funny colored. Ah! Oh boy, that hurt! <laughs> yeah, those guys are mean. I killed one of them. That's right, in your face. He's like, who hit me? I did. Oh. Payback. I get it. Uh. <laughs> I thought I was about to die. I remember to use my dash ability. I think I'm forgetting. I could be dashing through them. Oh, that shot hurt. Oh, how much do I lose when I go back? I mean, I still have my coins and stuff. I guess that's a thing. I got, oh, now that I'm here, since I have my coins, I guess I can go into the forge and we can upgrade again. Upgrade the swords or this thing with this crazy aftershock ability. Um, this does power 20. You know what? I wonder if I upgrade the daggers. They have a special ability to them. I'm gonna try upgrading these. Uh, or can I not? No, yeah, there we go. Upgrade. Got me up to 26 on a single upgrade. Power, and it's power level 21 now. I guess that aftershock ability is maybe better. Let's try equipping these. We'll see what they're like. Um, these things I could salvage. We'll get a little bit of money out of them, I guess. Since I'm not using them right now, anyway. I can even salvage one of these. I don't think I want to just yet. I need 320 coins to upgrade this thing again. I don't have that. Alright, I'm gonna see if I can get back up. I teleported right back down where I was there. I got a little bit of work to do to get- oh, wow. Okay, so you get- wow, different- different moving sequences when you've got different weapons. That's neat. Ah! Ow! Right. Use a weapon. If I would actually remember to shoot my ranged weapon a little more often, I probably wouldn't get his bad. Yeah, like that. <laughs> I like that there's different uh, there's different moves and stuff with the different types of weapons. So the things I'm using now are like daggers. They seem to have a lower reach. But it's got that aftershock ability thing that I could trigger. It's only like a 7% chance. It's not great, but it might come in handy on like, I don't know, like boss fights or something, maybe. I'm assuming there'll be boss fights in it. Oh. <laughs> I had to go down that way anyway. All right. Well, I got some free coins. All right. I fought my way back up here again. Ooh, I got armor this time. So it looks like every time I go through here and kill that guy, I've got an opportunity to get some stuff. That's all right. I didn't have armor before, and that is going to come in handy. Gives me higher health. And also, some, I, I gather it's going to give you some damage resistance or whatever. What was it there? 17 power, 28 health. So I don't know that it necessarily gives me resistance to damage, but it gives me higher power. So I'll take that. Ah. Uh, stop hitting me. Okay, that's just... You know, help of, I would do a lot better at games like this if I could avoid getting hit maybe a little bit more often. Ow! Sucker me with that. There again. That's right. Eat it. I can't decide whether I like the daggers more or if I like the uh, the sword more. I mean, the sword was handy because it's got it's 
got a better reach to it, which is nice. Ooh, that was an upgrade, I think. Only 10 power, 25 health. No, that was not an upgrade. But we can scrap that later. We can get a little extra coin for it. We can use to upgrade our other equipment. Let's get down here and kill this guy off. Let's bank him a little bit. I'm gonna heal up before I go up top. That range gap there is what killed me before. See ya, buddy. Ow, that hurt. Okay, I can't, I can't reach. I gotta go back up here. Owned you. Oh no, wait, this is the guy that killed me. Not this time. Oh! Got past one attack, I think I almost got shot. Okay, so. Ow! Oh, that hurt. Stop shooting me. Pick that up, thank you. I think that was another weapon. Oh, is that like a fiery. Yeah! You can't get past that thing. I'm guessing I can't really walk on it either. Ow. Turns out getting hit in this game is bad for your health. Who knew? Oh, come on. He's right there. All you have to do is aim at him. Ow. I'm hoping at some point in the future we get an opportunity to block because uh, it'd be nice if I could block some of these attacks. If I was just more conscious about dodging that would probably help too I get into like a uh, combo attack moves or whatever by hitting X too much and then I can't get out of the way the heal get out of the red oh I can oh yep that definitely hurts <laughs> definitely can't shoot you. another range weapon pistol uh, that's probably not as good as what I've got now these ones are saying they're better 10% chance to apply stasis Oh, okay, they're better because they're like, I've got a common one, and these are like uncommon or rare or something. They've got an ability associated with them, so they can do a little bit more, I guess. I should probably upgrade one of these things to get used to that. Oh, this one's got higher DPS, 34 versus 29. It's a shotgun. Oh, <laughs> let's try the shotgun out. See how well that works. I think this is like a little bonus room again. That's interesting. All right. I don't see that we can go anywhere up here, so I guess we gotta go down. Uh, preferably not into the fire. Oh! That's a turret! Oh, damn. That's a turret. I'm getting out of here. Oh, no. Don't run on the fire. <laughs> I have no way to heal over there. I can't go that way. At least down here, if I hit some enemies, I can at least do something? What's up here? If I hit them, I have a leech ability, so I will get a little bit of uh, a little bit of healing. It's not a lot, though. I'm not sure what I get for each individual hit, but let's, let's try it. He's down. No! Oh, that was neat. Shotgun's cool. It's a little slower shooting, but... Why do they have a turret there with nothing behind it? There's gotta be, there's gotta be something there. I wanna find out. Ah, but I'm almost dead. <laughs> I've got like no healing power. Oh, I guess I gotta go that way. That's, oh, you know what? The switch is up there. I've gotta hit the switch to open the door. So I've gotta get past the turret in order to do that. Ah, oh, I put the slide under it. Turret to the face. Oh, I have to. I have to admit, I'm finding this game actually a little bit more challenging than I was expecting. Some of the enemies are pretty tough. The uh, the range guys in particular do a lot of damage. Um, so in a situation like this, where I don't have a ranged weapon handy right now, or all the ammo rather, finding those guys is a little bit trickier. Uh, as I play the game, I'm sure I'll get better at evasion and stuff, so I'm not getting hit quite so often, but. Oh, that hurt my face, buddy. Okay, so this is where we got to last time. Well, we got a little bit farther. Oh, no, no, I fell in the fire. Oh, that was bad. 
Okay, so we've got to get past that turret. That, that thing owned my face before. I should probably get to that thing before I get hurt too much. As I get shot. Excellent time. Oh, man. Even when I think I can slide under those things, it's just not working too well. Okay, so the turret was on this level? Yeah, there it is. Ah! I think I took all three of those shots, so that was just great. Uh, right button activate. This will open the door down below. I could go and kill those other guys and earn some coins and some blue things. Um, but I think for now, we'll just get down here and see what's on the other side of the door. <laughs> the shotgun I picked up is pretty sweet. It does a decent amount of damage and has a chance of, like, if there's more than one target standing together, you can get them both. Oh, stop shooting me. Not to mention the individual shot damage of it is... Oh! Significantly higher. Like, I can one-shot those guys sometimes. Pretty sweet. I'm gonna grab this. Oh, another one-shot. I'm not sure if it's critting or if it's, it's just like the raw damage that's that. I'm not kind of to do that, but... I won't complain. Uh, that did not hit the range guy, which is who I actually really wanted to hit with that. Uh, Point-blank shot to the face. Another ring. I'm getting all kinds of random junk I can scrap now. Oh boy, that hurt. <laughs> I don't like them anymore. That was my last shot. So there's a range guy up top that's going to be a problem. Since I don't have enough... Well, I, got, I can heal a little bit here. Uh, I got to make a point of using that dash ability too. I keep forgetting to use that thing. Okay, good. We can do that. Dash through them and then own them. Yeah, it does a decent amount of damage, so I should probably use it a little bit more on those range guys. And turrets, too, probably. Oh, as I tried to use it and realized I didn't have it charged up. <laughs> Bad plan. Not good. What the heck is this dude's deal? Alright, that's some kind of special guy. I don't really want to get owned by him right now. Go down here. Um, I have a tiny little bit. I I think in order to charge that thing up, I've got to like... No, I can't do that. In order to charge up my heal ability, I think I've got to attack stuff. And that might be where that leech skill comes into play. Let me get this guy up on the right side here. Oh, man, that thing hurts. <laughs> I keep getting killed and sent back to here. And I think I had 263 coins. Yeah, it's putting me right back. It's a very... Uh, a little bit Dark Souls esque, and then when you die, you drop a bunch of stuff on the ground. And I don't know that it's there to go to pick up when you go back. You have to like earn your way back through it. You only get to keep what you get when you get to the next waypoint, which is definitely going to make this tricky. Uh, I clearly need a little bit more practice at the game, but we'll come back and try this again another time, maybe. Uh, leave a comment down below. Let me know what you think about the uh, about the game. This again is Forgone. The link is in the description down below to where you can get on the Epic Game Store. And again, I believe it's out on February 27th. I'm as always Cryptic Fox. I'll see all of you next time.